Hi, I'm Alex from TechniqueTV.com and I'm here to show you how to set up spaces on your Macintosh computer. First, you're going to want to open up System Preferences found in either your dock or in the Apple menu in the top left hand corner of your screen. Under the Personal group, go to the fourth icon over that says Expose in Spaces and click on it. You are going to want to make sure you're under the Spaces tab so if you're on expose, hit the spaces. You are going to want spaces enabled. The show spaces in menu bar, in order to click that, it does just that. It shows what space you are in the menu bar. For example, I'm in space one, space two, space three, and space four. To add rows, go to the right side of the system preferences menu and click the plus sign. So you subtract, click the minus sign. And same with the columns. Plus gives you more and minus will give you less. Now over here where it says application assignments, click the plus button and a program you want. I'll use system preferences. So the application assignments shows what space you assign the program to. For example, if you want system preferences to always open in space 3, click that. Or if you want it to be in every space, click that button. As you can see, 3, 4, 1, 2. Alright. To activate spaces, you can assign any key to it from F1 to F13, or you can just leave it blank. To switch between spaces, you can either use Option in the arrow keys, Command in the arrow keys, or Control in the arrow keys to switch between. So here's Command in the right arrow will take me right, Command in the down arrow will take me down, Command in the left arrow will take me to the left, and Command in up will take me up. To switch directly to a space, um, you can either press Option in a number key, Command in a number key, or control in the number key. For example, if I want to go to space 4, I'll hit command in 4, or command in 3 for space 3, command in 2 for space 2, or command in space 1 for space 1. Thank you for watching this tutorial, and please comment, subscribe, and thumbs up. And for more tech videos, visit us at TechniqueTV.com.